24/7 teachers training a lesson by lesson tutorial for homogeneous teaching we are an edtech textbook publisher bismillahir rahmanir rahim assalamu alaikum dear teacher i welcome you on behalf of the snowman publishers to an online tutorial on section 1 of chapter 2 of science grade 4 which covers the topic ecosystems the video will cover various types of ecosystems biotic and abiotic factors of ecosystem so let's get started with the teaching plan like in every lesson welcome the students with a cheerful smile and say assalamu alaikum ask them to sit and say how are you introduce to them the topic and write ecosystems in prominent letters on the board start the lesson with an interesting activity and tell them to hold their nose with mouth closed and try not breathing for a few seconds perform the activity with them then ask them questions like why could we not hold our breath for long What happens if there is no air or if the air is polluted Conclude this brainstorming session by explaining that air is essential to our survival Ask can you name any other factors we need to survive Help the children answer and write all the factors on the board one by one such as water plants and animals for food light etc explain that we get these things from our surrounding environment called ecosystem every living thing lives in some kind of ecosystem that fulfills its needs use flash card to discuss different ecosystems such as deserts grasslands oceans ponds and forests ask the students can you guess what type of animals live in each ecosystem help them answer and add more points refer back to the list of different factors of survival you wrote on the board ask the students can you tell which of these factors are living things and which ones are non living make a circle around the living things tell them that the living things in an ecosystem are called its biotic factor point to the non living things listed on board and explain that these are called abiotic factors of the ecosystem write the missing factors of any as an activity tell the students to think about the school and tell which abiotic and biotic factors they can identify for fun you may divide the class in two groups and ask one group to tell biotic and the other to name the biotic factors in the school the group with the longer list wins this will encourage the students to do focused thinking and remember the concept discuss that all biotic factors counted as plants are called producers because they make their own food every other living thing in the ecosystem is called a consumer because they eat prepared food introduce that the consumers might be carnivores herbivores or omnivores explain three groups with the help of the textbook as an activity write the names of 7 to 10 animals insects birds etc on the board and ask students to group each of them in one of the three categories if they give a wrong answer correct them and explain the reasons politely discuss that the biotic and abiotic factors in an ecosystem must be balanced for the ecosystem to function properly give an example of the absence of sunlight and ask do you know what will happen if an abiotic factor such as sunlight is absent in an ecosystem what if a place runs out of water explain the consequences of such an imbalance and discuss the ways to preserve ecosystem 
For homework, you can ask the students to find out and write three examples of herbivores, carnivores and omnivores in their notebook. Thank you, honorable teacher, for your listening. Allah Hafiz.